Hello, happy Thursday. It is 44 degrees in Mont Bellevue, Texas, and I am making a cup of tea. I want to show you my new thing. I'm so excited. It's the first time I've ever used it. And my stove top is disgusting because I made eggs and toast earlier and I haven't wiped everything up. So my apologies. I've got water going in the kettle. I've got one of my favorite teacups that I got uh, from Partridge's in London. I did a video in that little store. I said I want to live here so I can shop here. But what I got inside ready to go is my little uh, brain fog. What do you call it? Anyway, I've never used these before. But I have a couple new ones and I love the shell shape. I thought it was so cute. So it's ready to go. Inside I have some berry bouquet. And this is from my friend Julie for my birthday. She gave me an outstanding package of all these different teas from this new shop in Galveston. I can't wait for us to go back together. And also in there, I have the rock sugar. I think rock sugar is just so much more elegant for hot tea. Um, I, I, I drink iced tea when I'm in a restaurant and I really like sweet and low because it dissolves quickly. And I'm okay with the taste because I just put a little smidgen in there. But when it comes to a hot drink like coffee or tea, I like real sugar. I don't like um, artificial sweeteners. I just don't like the saccharin taste in it. But I've always thought that the rock sugar in a cup of tea is just a little bit more elegant. And water's boiling. So when I pour that over, you're going to hear the rock sugar go crack, 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 crack. One of my favorite parts. <laughs> Here we go, right over the little tea thing. What do you call that, a tea basket? Did you hear the sugar crackle and crack? Oh, love it, love it so much. So I'm gonna let that sit in there for a while. Matter of fact, I'm gonna leave it in there because I love these herbal teas um, and these fruit-based teas, I love them, but they don't come out as dark as I like, but they sure taste delicious. But anyway, that's what's going on today. It's nice and chilly, the wind is blowing Gary, the wind is blowing so hard it has knocked off one of the um here we go brain fog what do you call those things on a ceiling fan the blade it has knocked off one of the blades off one of the ceiling fans on the patio <sighs> anyway y'all have a wonderful thursday bye